Hey guys, hey. it's Melissa. And it's Doug. <laughs> so today is the day everyone's been waiting for. We have decided um, that regarding the black tank on the RV, um, we are going to have to get it unclogged uh, before we can cut it off and create a composting toilet. So today's the day that we have to uh, unclog it. Um, I've gotten several bits of advice from some RV friends and it's not gonna be a clean job. Um, but it's gotta be done. So it is what it is, it's part of the journey. We're gonna take you along. We'll try not to show you the dirty stuff, but um, Make do it my, messy. We're gonna do our best not to show you the dirty stuff. <laughs> so enjoy, today's gonna be um, a dirty long day. <laughs> Got my poop jacket all zipped up in case in case we get any splashage. Splashage. Splashing. Poop juice. Got our tools of the tree. Outside. <laughs> Here we go. Los Kits. I'm gonna have a close it.
This is the length of the thickness of the pipe. Pretty much. Huh? Pretty much. So, so you, you need to have the pliers on here in order to push it in. Mm -hmm. No, no, that's teamwork. It's not actually.
Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, he is. No suction. Might have gotten a little bit, but there's no moisture. Checked on the outside, it's completely clogged. Seems to be some solid stuff in there. I'm gonna check out now the inside, see, oops, see what we can do. Uh, to unclog it or maybe even remove the toilet completely and move on because at one point uh, this thing is gonna go and be put in a, a composting toilet in there. All right, you see, okay. Yes, just a normal wrench. Both sides, just a normal toilet. Yeah, so I'm gonna go inside, get some, get the ratchet, and uh, the pooper is gonna say goodbye. <laughs> So I'm gonna take the water line off. Oh, and as you guys can see, I finished up the cabinets that we just painted black. Sanded them all down so they have that rustic look. The toilet has also a very rustic look. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, and no, I need the second channel lock to hold it in place. Can't be that far. No water. 
we gotta black this sooner or later. That's a good thing. So now everything out of the way. gerade die Toilette raus und äh, das Wasser ist abgeklemmt. Ich mache die Schrauben locker und dann schmeißen wir den Müll und dann kommt der Komposttoilette oben drauf. So, mal gucken. Hello, I'm good. I'm good. First try. It's not the right size. It's not even tight. <laughs> Nummer eins. Uh, Nummer zwei. Oh. So now. Make room for the throne. Yeah. I'm not sure, so I'm gonna take this off now. I'm gonna take this off, put it on the plastic. Most likely, it's no water like in a real toilet. And there we go, and it goes in the trash can. Yep, that's all it is. On the front. Oh, hello, hello. It's just so much paper in there. It's you just don't want to see? So, solid. <coughs> <laughs> Nothing that I have seen before. I used to work in the casino for seven years. And there's a lot of stuff going down. Keys, cars, glasses, underwear. Belts. Mm -hmm. um, you'll be surprised what I found there. Yeah? Okay, so here we go. It, it goes. There's not even anything prepping. Nope, there is a little bit. But it's not poop, it's just that water goes. Okay. Here it goes. Goodbye. Free. So many stuff. This is a no normal. Um, I think it's called a flunge. We will put a normal toilet on. Instead of a wax ring, is a rubber ring. Guess we should get the bucket. We can get the bucket and some long gloves. No, I'm just kidding. These are good. No holes in there. Could it be empty? Um, what do you mean? Like just packed right here at the top? We will know in a minute or so. Could this wire hanging needs to also go because I need a hook in there. It's it's like somebody stuffed this in there. I mean, really, I would almost like have a, a hook or something, a screwdriver, because it's, it's actually. I mean, Solid paper. Pure. Some of it's even white still. Paper. Like not, dry. Not composed of. Wow. Yeah. Every 
no chance in hell you can loosen this up. So, yeah. That's the new poop driver. Actually, you need a drill for this shit. <laughs> oh, here's a fingernail. <laughs> the body is. Oh, yeah. As right. you can see, I'm smart. He's just can handle some stuff. It's not even full completely. Yeah. It was just a hole. The, the pipe going down was stuffed, and the pipe is like this long. And it's like two inch pipe, metal pipe most likely. And it was just stuffed with the toilet paper. So there's actually, I'm actually looking at fluid though. Some fluidy stuff right here. The tank seems to be have only was something on the bottom. And you can now see. Less than an inch until I hit the bottom here. That's metal. So less than an inch in here. The thing is actually, or at least it looks, it looks here that it's not. Virtually empty? This much fluid until. See? So there's got to be something blocking the other hole. Correct. If there's still a little fluid in there. So the auger is the, the thing to do. And this will also go good by now. Yep, so um, I could actually take this out. Let me close it up for tonight. And now we know we won't experience gushing water so on the other side as soon as we clear it. There's no pressure and that tank is less than an inch full of fluid. Take that curtain down too. That's very 1970s. People make some nice, cute curtains. <coughs> I found some stuff to redo the counters with as well, so we'll probably be doing that. So it does look like um, this thing, and the pipe going into the tank, is connected somehow. It maybe sticks in there, or maybe it's sealed with something. So I'm not taking this out because it looks like it's moving as one solid piece. So I leave this in for now until it's time to take care of the tank. Go in for safety. Now. a heavy foil plastic bag. For now.
that seals it. So we don't have to smell in here. Wunderbar! Wunderbar! So, das Loch ist zu und es stinkt nicht mehr. Das sollte gut sein für heute.